Now let's talk <laughs> over here to uh, Christophe in France. Christophe from France, welcome to your show, buddy. Christophe, how are you, my friend? Uh, hello, Uncle Bob, Belle uh, It's always a pleasure seeing you every week. Uh, these days are important in my life. Thank you. It's important to talk to you because you're my friend, and I'll see you when I get to France probably in May, okay? Okay. Thank you for being there uh, to answer questions from your fans and make us the pleasure of sharing your memories of your beautiful career. Yeah, we'll go out somewhere, and I'll talk to the audience, I mean, uh, my French friends. Okay, now what's on your mind, my friend? Uh, today I've prepared three questions about uh, different fr friendships. Okay, go ahead. Okay, first, Larry Maniti is your friend uh, for um, uh, many years uh, this day to back, uh, back to yeah. your beginnings in Chicago, but uh, how are you become friends? Well, I started, tell us about I started his career. Uh, he had a, I, I had a, f a friend named Emo Monaco uh, who had a um, fabulous restaurant that I entertained at, and he started seeing my mother. And uh, I was in um, New York, and uh, I needed to come back from New York to uh, – Los Angeles, and I didn't have the funds, and I called the email, and I said, Emo, listen, do me a favor. Can you help me? And he said, sure, I'm going to send you first class one way to Los Angeles. And I said, I can't thank you enough. He said, and when it's time for payback, I will let you know. I said, thank you, Mo. That was his nickname. And I came to uh, Los Angeles, and the rest is sort of history. And he called me one day, and he said, hey, there's a guy here, and I'm a friend of his father's. And he wants to get his acting career started. And I said, yeah. I said, what's his name? He says, Larry Manetti. And I said, well, when Larry gets here, have him call me. And, of course, the rest is history. Oh, thank you for the stories, Uncle Bob. Okay, what else? Um, we know all your friendship with Connie Stevens. Uh, can you tell us about uh, her uh, since when, when you are your friends? Yeah, well, I met her at the Academy Awards, and she was 19 years old. And I went there with Nick Adams because he wanted to try and sell a TV series. And there were people there that were in a position to um, to buy it. And he said, so I'm not going to take a woman and leave the tail and be rude to her, so I'm going to take you. So it was the first time I ever saw the Academy Awards. I saw all these people waiting outside and making noise and screaming and everything. I said, what the hell is going on? And then I sat at this table, and there was a beautiful little blonde girl. And I said, hi, how are you? And she said, I'm fine. I said, how old are you? She said, I'm 19. I said, oh, I'm 22. She said, I'm an actress. I said, oh, well, good. It's nice meeting you, Connie. And she said, it's nice meeting you too, Robert. And then um, a friend of mine came over, and he said, listen, uh, Warner's the table wants to see you. So I went over there, and I said, yes, sir. And I said, we want you to come and uh, test for a television series, and uh, we'll call your agent. I said, I'm under contract to Warner Brothers. And he said, oh, okay. Well, then I'll make arrangements to, through the studio. And that's the rest of his history. And I did Hawaiian Night with Connie Stevens. And we're still, yes. still, still dear friends. Okay, Uncle I have a last question. Uh, all your fans know uh, that you, you are faithful in friendship. Uh, we noticed through your career, uh, as uh, we often see appear your uh, friends by your side in your different benefits. Uh, how impose you, uh, your friends, uh, in your shots? I don't understand the question. Uh, we noticed to look your career, uh, we often uh, see appear your friends by uh, by your side in your various benefits. Yeah, well, without the, without you, you know, I wouldn't have had a career. It's all about us. It's about you and me and what what happened. And without you, there was no career. Okay. Okay, Uncle Bob, that's it for my phone call. Uh, thank you for answering so kindly my question. Uh, next uh, next it's week. To be able to speak with you. Next week. Thank Mer you. Merci and au revoir. God bless you. Thank you. God bless you.